Hey, what is up you guys? Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we're talking about Beat Saber once again. The game has just been updated now to version 1.1. Five. So some of you may have opened up the game and realized, hey, what's going on? Where's all my stuff gone? What I actually figured out is that my custom songs were still in the game. Avatars and Sabres were not. So don't worry. If you go back to the previous videos where I showed you how to install mods and stuff, this still applies. Mod Assistant still works with it. All you have to do is just reinstall the, uh, the mods to the game. So if you are new to this video, you're new to the channel, I'm going to show you how to do that anyway. Okay, but for those who are familiar with this, all you have to do is just go back to Mod Assistant, basically reinstall the mod. You, ha you have to open the game first. Just do that, okay? Which I'm sure you, you will have done anyway. If you haven't, just play the game first and then exit out of the game and reinstall the mods. Let's get into the more important stuff, okay? All right, so just go ahead and check on the Oculus desktop app. I'm going to go to Library, uh, Beat Saber. Just click on these three dots here details and just to show you guys version 1.15.0 updated just a day ago so you've played the game if you haven't just play the game once and then exit out the game if you haven't if you don't know how to mod the game i'll leave a link in the description on where to download mod assistant once you have that downloaded and installed you want to just open up mod assistant and if you open up mod assistant for the first time it's going to ask you to locate the Beat Saber install directory. Okay, so while I'm here, I'm actually going to explain this to you guys right now. If you don't know where your Beat Saber game install is, go back to the Oculus app. And it actually says it here. So home, go to your library. Beat Saber's here, it's already installed. Just click on these three dots again, go to details. And then here it says location. So for example, mine's in the D drive, Oculus games, software, backslash hyperbolic, magnetism, Beat Saber. Just to show you that actually in the file explorer, open up file explorer. I'm gonna head over to this PC, D drive, Oculus games. So you're looking for this folder. Let me see if we can get that bigger. You're looking for this folder right here. Okay, open that, get these larger again. Uh, then you want this folder, software, make them larger again. And then you are looking for this phone here, Hyperbolic Magnetism Beat Saber. So as you can see in my directory now, it's got old plugins. I'm just going to leave those there. Beat Saber data is if you want to install uh, custom maps yourself. Just head over to custom levels and here are all your custom maps. I'll leave a link in the description again on a website where you can download custom maps manually, but it's easier to actually download them inside the game because it installs them directly to the game. But yeah, that's basically where your custom levels are once they are installed anyway. Custom sabers, again, you put them into this folder. Custom avatars, put them into this folder. As, as you can see, I've got a few already. Right, okay, so back to Mod Assistant. Just before I continue, if you guys are liking this video already, I would really appreciate it if you left a thumbs up, smash that like button, would really appreciate it. If you are new to the channel and you want to help support, then maybe consider subscribing. It would really help me out a lot. Thank you guys so much. All right, so we're back in Mod Assistant. What you actually want to do is just go to Options, Install Folder. As you can see here, this is where my installation directory is. But if you are doing this for the first time, select Folder, and it's going to bring you to here, well, wherever, just this PC and wherever your game is installed, okay? New volume D, which is where mine is, Oculus Games, software, hyperbolic magnetism, Beat Saber. All you have to do is just double click that, open it, and then click save, okay? Then once you've done that, head over to the mods tab, and here you've got a long list of mods. Feel free to go through them. Check which ones you want. I've just got the very basic like camera two. You definitely want camera two. I recommend that. It's just so you can get that really wide field of view and smooth camera. It's so good. Saber Factory is also pretty awesome. Custom avatars, you guys will want that. And yeah, I'll I'll leave that to you guys, okay, to do that. So once you've got them checked, you want to then click install or update. So whether you're doing this for the first time or you're doing it since the game update, all you just have to do is just reinstall or update the mods, okay? And then it'll reapply it to the game and you're good to go. 
Also, before we continue, just make sure the game version is 1.13.4. Do not worry about this. It still works with 1.15. So just ignore that. Okay. I think that is pretty much it. I've actually just hit a brick wall. I can't think right now. Um, oh, one last thing. Okay. If you haven't installed your games into like a separate folder to your Oculus software is if that makes sense so if i head over to my c drive which is where windows and everything's installed go to your program files oculus so this is where the entire oculus software is installed and you also click on software here yeah so by default your games could possibly be in there actually so if you guys are saying to me i don't know where my beat saber game folder is go to your c drive program files oculus again same principle software um software i'm assuming it's going to be there it will be it should be so let me just uh, rewind a little bit so if you want to create a separate folder an installation folder for where your games are, you want to go to ba -ba -da -ba, general okay library locations this is where we'll put apps that you install from the oculus store click edit and then if you some of you guys it might just have this one C drive or whatever drive you have, uh, just click add location. Then basically whatever drive you have on your PC, just, uh, yeah, create a new folder, select that folder. And then in future, whatever games you install, you should then install it to that folder. So as you can see mine here, D Oculus games, I've got nine apps on there, 13.89 gigabyte used with 288 gigabyte free space so i know i'm not amazing at explaining things where are we at here oh i hope that worked i just looked at my obs and it looked like it glitched out of me i hope that was helpful please please do let me know if it worked and you did find it helpful again if you haven't already smash the thumbs up button would really really appreciate it let me know in the comments below if it helped and also if you've got any questions i would rather you join me in discord just drop me a question in there if you have any issues it's easier if you just send me screenshots because some of the issues that you guys have i don't really understand i'm just like what i have no idea with that being said i'm going to end the video right there and um also keep your eyes peeled on the community tab I like to keep very active on my YouTube channel and it's kind of a shame to see that nobody is interacting with my uh, community posts, some of the polls that I put up on there. It would be really super awesome if you guys could just like, maybe like take a second to just, I don't know, vote on a poll or like a poll or comment on some of the stuff. I don't know. It's just because I'm sad and I've got no friends. If you want to see more of me, hit subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next video. All right, I'm going now.